James, last question. Do you like, you not like us? <laughs> Thank you, Jay Frank. James, last question. Do you like, you not like us? <laughs> Thank you, Jay Frank. Okay, man, so this is a crazy situation. Now, I don't understand the reason why anyone can pull up on Jay Prince and ask him about Not Like Us by Kendrick Lamar. Now, we have to check up on this guy and know if this guy is really good because, bruh, you all have a lot of nerves. I mean, aren't you scared of Jay Prince? Now, I understand that this situation happened in Houston and this dude happens to be a blogger or whatever posted on social media. Now, a big shout out to you, bro, because I really needed this video. I've been looking for this type of video for a very long time. And when it comes to Drake, Jay Prince is one of the people that don't keep quiet whenever you try to disrespect Drake. Now, go listen to that song, Not Like Us. Kendrick Lamar was actually firing shot at Jay Prince because he knows that Jay Prince is the only street ninja who will come out to defend Drake. Now, you don't want to play with that type of person. Now, in the industry, we understand that Jay Prince is so powerful in the street that he always comes in whenever the streets gets involved with the entertainment industry and stuff like that. Now, at this point, Jay Prince said, hey, listen up, I don't, even, I don't even like that song. Now, you can see his reaction. I made a video previously talking about this situation because this is about the street business. And I think that Jay Prince actually kept quiet on this situation. He focused on the business, you know, focused on his hustle and stuff like that. His boxing, uh, you know, business and all that crazy stuff. That is what he's been posting on his social media. Now, I understand the fact that he took it to the street because he knows that. Nah, bruh, Drake House was being shot at. Trust me. Not only Rick Ross going to Canada and getting jumped. Now we're talking about people coming to Drake house to, you know, shoot at, at Drake's house. I mean, that was so crazy that Drake have to go to Houston to purchase a new house and move to Houston, right? For that protection. Now, Jay Prince have to get involved to make sure that he gives Drake the type of protection that he needs. Because at this point, bro, the beef in the street, the street ninjas are getting involved. And the only place that Drake can be at and be well protected is Houston. Now, this dude is pulling up on Jay Prince, asking Jay Prince, do you like, not like us, Drake distract by Kendrick? Bro, you must be crazy. You must be crazy, bro. This is so risk. You, you know, you're risking your life at this point because Jay Prince might turn around and say, okay, cool. Did Kendrick send you to ask me this question? Trying to see what I can say? Because after the controversy of Takeoff and all these people, and, you know, when some type of people was coming at Drake and stuff like that, Jay Prince came out, made a video, made a public statement, you know, NBA young boy and all these people, he sent them a serious warning, telling them, listen up, you have to stop effing with Drake because Drake is my son right so he sees drake as his son because drake is making a lot of money for the prince family now remember the story and the history of jazz prince being the one that discovered drake you know introduced drake to win and wheezy was actually okay cool this dude sounds good and they put drake on the hustle put the money on top of him and he got the opportunity to become one of the biggest artists in the world now that's a lot of money for you know prince family now you want to f with that type of money Bruh, you must be crazy, right? You must be crazy. You don't want to ask that type of question to this man. I think personally that's so disrespectful because this dude is literally inside the factory or inside a warehouse or stuff like that and literally in Houston asking the praise himself, do you like Drake this track not like hers? Bruh, you all have to stop doing this. Now, if I'm a blogger, who goes around interviewing people, asking people some question, you know, putting camera on their faces. I will not do stuff like this because personally, I know that's risky. I know that's disrespectful and there must be a consequences for that type of action. You get what I'm saying? So no matter what you think, man, Jay Prince will always support Drake. He will always be on Drake team and all that crazy stuff, man. And that's, 
that's some reality so if you don't accept that reality i don't know what you want to accept so let me know what you all think man smash that like button subscribe to the channel turn on notification bell so you all get notified whenever i drop a new video and if you're feeling generous today you can send the support thanks to the channel 